Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kevin Prasad. Welcome to another video on astrology, Vastu and Palmistry. So today we are going to talk about the um, Lagna Lord. So basically the Lagna Lord in a various bhavas. Like people are asking in the YouTube comments and uh, other uh, uh, social media and other interactions, people are asking, okay, what is the result here? And if Lagna Lord is in this bhava, as well, right? I thought let's make this video like for covering all the 12 houses, right? If the Lagna Lord sits in the Lagna only, right, it doesn't matter which Lagna we are talking about and which planet we are talking about. It doesn't matter, right? Any planet, the Lagna Lord is sitting in Lagna itself. The positive side is it is pretty good, pretty strong, right? That person has a very good, strong uh, uh, mental ability, confident, you know, that person... And then the person will have a good sound health. All that is positive. On the negative side, what is what it means is the person will have a lot of ego. He will first put only his interest first on everything else. It doesn't matter what about other things. He will put first his interest. Okay. That is what it happens for the uh, Lagna Lord sitting in the Lagna. And if the Lagna Lord goes to the second house, what happens is that means the family is very much, uh, he will uh, love his family. Okay. At the same time, the uh, he will try to control the family. He will try to control the family running. Right, it doesn't matter whether he's the eldest uh, child or the youngest child, doesn't matter. That person wants to control the family, or family will be here, uh, you know. So, you will have more control of the family, and at the same time, second house is also for uh, income money. So, that person also will be running behind money. Okay, the person will always want to earn more money. That is possibility and other possibility is trying to be with the family and try to control the family. If the Lagna Lord sits in third house, means third house is what? Short travels. So this person will be always indulged in traveling, short travels. Either he will be traveling to many places or he will be working in a like a traveling job. Or, or the other comment, other situation is the, his siblings will will be needing his help. So he will go uh, willfully go and try to help their uh, his uh, siblings, especially the younger siblings, brother and sister, right? And anything whatever he wants to do, he will put his more efforts more because third house is also initiative, own initiative. Right, so the Lagna Lord sitting there. That means he will put a lot of initiatives. It doesn't matter, uh, you know, where, whether it workplace or at home or anywhere else. Uh, if you go and ask somebody volunteer, okay, can you do this uh, work or can somebody come forward? Then these persons will be the persons who will raise their hands. Right, so that type of thing will be there. If the Lagna Lord goes to the fourth house. Fourth house is again what? Real estate, education, right? Either the person will be very much interested in reading, learning, right? Or you might see like some people like always they will have a big list of degrees and things like that. Or the person will be always with the, with the book. That is one. Other the situation is the they will be running behind properties, real estate. They love buying properties, right? Whether they have that money or not, that all depends on other bhavas and other planets, right? But uh, we are just talking about the Lagna law. So they love real estate. They love, love investing or buying real estate. And they also love their mother most, most, right? They always want to be with the mother or the motherland, right? Okay. So now let's go to the fifth house. Fifth house is what? Children, right? So one 
no, lagna lord going to the fifth house means they will be after children they love their children the most okay or they will be very much interested in the extracurricular activities they will be very much interested in the sports music when during their teenage or the end age they also be very much to have a love relationship that all that is possible all of this or many of this or one of this will will happen if the lagna lord goes to sixth house that means what sixth house is enemies right the enemies loans debts service job right so this person a they will they want to work you go and ask them talk to them okay why can you uh, can we start a business can we do a business can you be a partner in the business they won't like it they say i would just want to do my job that is one possibility other possibility is they they themselves will go and keep on taking loans right whether they will uh, you know repay it back or not that's a different issue but they will keep on be keep on taking loans or they will be just poking their enemies or, or like the, there will be always fight with their enemies or opponents so that is also a possibility Yeah. and the lagna lord goes to the seventh house seventh house is what spouse right partners so they love their partners they love their spouse they will do anything for their spouse whatever it doesn't matter whether male or female if in a woman's in a lady's horoscope lagna lord sits in the seventh house she will do anything for her husband for her spouse same thing a uh, male horoscope anything on business partners also even if they cheat these people will say will forgive and then let's move on right let's be partners and then let's continue the business that is how their mentality will be eighth house eighth house is again a, another tricky house dushtana right sudden changes legacies eighth house also unknown income this persons in the combination of five if there is a connection between fifth house and the eighth house lagna lord sits in the eighth house that means they will be very much interested in speculation gambling right gambling means not just playing cards or going to horse races even stock trading is also a gamble speculation right high risk high reward they always want that high reward they think oh i if i do this i will get so much money they will be after that and other other things if they are not doing it it means or they will be in connect in connection with in the uh, retirement benefits or life insurance policies and things like that they will be very much uh, interested in the life insurance policies they will be preaching about the life insurance policies like that or worst cases another scenario is they could be working in the uh, accident departments or right uh, emergency e ambulances and things like that that is eighth house so now let's uh, go to ninth house if the lagna lord is sits in the ninth house ninth house is what teaching preaching right and then father so they will be attached to the father or uh, always they want to attach be, uh, have an attachment to the father the most and then they love teaching preaching right it does the uh, preaching that's what i'm saying please note the word preaching preaching means it could be anything right either you uh, you preach uh, a philosophy or spirituality or you know any subject but again ninth house is also connected to the spirituality most likely they will enjoy talking about the spirituality or preaching about spirituality and again they will be fond of doing long distance travel foreign country travel okay so either they they will be like very much interested in going out of their birthplace and uh, exploring or living in foreign countries or living in making long distance travel most next 10th house 10th house is what profession karma sthan right they will be always running after karma running after profession in a simple word if i say 
they they could be mostly like a workaholic they give importance to the work right that is what they will do whether the work is giving the result or not that's a different issue but they will be workaholic they will be always they put preference they give preference to work 11th house 11th house is what fulfillment right gains so the moment first house goes to 11th house the lagna lord goes to 11th house that means their their only single motive is gains without any gain to them they will not indulge in any work they will not do any work at all there has to be gain and the last house 12th house 12th house is what expenses losses right all that this 12th house is just again flip from the 11th house these people don't mind spending even they will they can easily throw a very expensive party or expensive function and things like that they will spend a lot of money or they will be in a away from their birthplace 12th house is also far away place away from their work workplace a uh, birthplace they will be working in a foreign uh, country or foreign land they will most likely settle there if it has a connection with the 9th house okay so the 12th house is again in, uh, losses losses been spending right they will be willfully spending so that means what they will give more charities they will willfully give the donations right they won't treat it as an expense they won't treat it as a loss right uh hope uh, you like this video we covered all the houses for every bhava for the lagna lord we will catch up on another time another day thank you